Hi everybody, it's your friendly neighborhood hanger Robin here. Welcome aboard the BTD-1. Also known as the Bloody Terrible. Yeah, this is the bird that started my channel way back in the day because a certain YouTuber kept saying how fucking great it is and it's a flying pile of trash. But you know what? For the 10th year anniversary of the Bloody Terrible being added to the game, I thought, you know, maybe with the cannonballs, Maybe they fixed it. You don't know. I don't know. Only one way to find out. But I know some of you are going to say, well, Harry, it don't look that bad. Yeah, it has a bug. It has a bug that's been in this game for 10 fucking years that they still have not fixed. Good God, guys, and I know you're lazy, but Jesus. Oh, Lord, not a... It's the gauntlet of Stalin. Really? Really, the first thing I'm going to run into is the fucking gauntlet? Jeez. Oh, come on. Please work. Please work. Oh, shit. Nope. 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 Oh. Good lord. For those that run under such things, 600 meter convergence and stealth. But yeah, as for the bug, this thing cannot fly in a straight line unless you turn on all of the freaking instructor crap. For those that don't know, like maybe you're on console and don't know about that because you can't turn off instructor crap in console. With the instructor crap on, there's a whole lot of moves that you can't do. Climbing spirals into a freaking head stall. You can't do the old over under flip thing. You can't get too damn close to the ground because the instructor will yank back on the stick. Yeah, there's a whole lot of nice pilot tricks that you can't really do with the instructor on. But without the instructor on, if you let go of the controls on this thing for more than a couple of seconds, it begins to oscillate. By that, I mean it'll start going back and forth, back and forth, as its wings go left, right, left, right, left, right, until eventually it will just flip over and crash. Yes, it will oscillate that badly. And the only way to fix it is to turn all that instructor crap on. Oh, hang on, H.A.K. I am coming, my Japanese bomber brother. Come on. Oh, naturally, could not get there in time. Good Lord, he's already dead. Quit kicking him, asshole. You come here. Thank you. Oh. And the bitches. I have watched videos from when this thing was first put in the game. It did had this bug back then. I know when I got this thing in like 2015, it had this bug. It's 2023. Why? Why does it still have this bug? It, this is ridiculous. Oh. And, and I don't even know why they put this in. Why didn't they put the prototype? The prototype would have been interesting and fun. For those that don't know, the original BTD prototype had 450 cows in the ass with a freaking back gunner. That would have been fun. Hell yeah, it had two and a blister right on the end of the tail and it had two right up behind the pilot. That would have been a blast. Hell yeah, you could be a flying gunship with that damn thing. It'd be like a sing uh, smaller P-61. That would have been cool. But no, we get this thing. One positive, though, is the air brakes on this thing are complete fat shit. Thank you, I will take that. Yeah, you can drop this thing from like 5, 6K straight down. Just pop that air brake and yeah, it, it, it literally breaks. It just, er, there you go. Oh, hope you like the skin. I got that off the market. Cost me like 17 cents or some shit. It's pretty, I'll give it that. Oh, but... But why why can't you fix the bug guy Jane? It can't be that complicated. Oh, there's a wyvern. Yeah I'm not gonna catch a wyvern. Uh come this way, Mr. Wyvern, please. Cause you know I can't chase you. Why don't you just take a head on? You're a wyvern. Your guns are so much better than mine. You get four Mark V Hispanos. I got two crappy A&M 3s. 
you'll win. I guarantee you'll win. I have slaughtered so many bloody terribles with that thing. Oh. And yeah, don't try any belts other than stealth. Because, yeah, I tried the air. I tried the ground. Oh, uh, yeah, on top of old Sparky, all covered in fail. Yeah, if you want to see this thing be a Hufflepuff, try those. Dude, seriously, it's already dead. Oh, events, man. Oh, I've got some requests for certain tanks. I told them, like, you're going to have to wait till after the event. Because events just throw everything all kinds of squirrely. Yeah, because they wanted a heavy tank, and I'm like, yeah, by the time I get to mid-map with all the freaking light tank spam, I'm like, please, sir, can I get a kill? Can I shoot something? No, because all the light tanks are already camping the enemy fucking spawn, and half of them's quit. Oh, and in planes, it's just as bad. Five million idiots that don't know what they're doing, shooting through everybody, trying to freaking steal every damn burning bird. Oh, so stupid. Go back to the old events. I miss the old events where you actually had to do things that took skills. Not just farm. Good God. Remember the old events? It was like get kills, get crits, get assists, bomb bases, and get wins. I like that. That gave you things to do. You know, challenges. No, it was get a four piece, not crits. It was so nice. Just go back to that and bring battle packs back to BR. I don't care if it's a 2.7, 3.7, whatever. Just put it back by BR. So all those beautiful birds that are at stupid things like freaking uh, the uh, XP-55. We could fly that. We could fly the 238. That would be funny as hell. Yeah, four-man squads of two, three-eighths doing bombing tasks? That would be a hoot. No, we can't have anything nice. Oh. Well, that was over pretty damn quickish. Look at that. My team's just a swarm left. Yeah. Tear the sky in a bloody terrible. Oh, and I got a, some stupid little steam thing. Whatever, I'll take it. Let's see how she paid, boys and girls. Man. Man, I'm bad. Now, for the 10th anniversary of Bloody Terrible, should you get it? <laughs> Hell no. There are so many better options for the Americans. You have the OP-50. You have the 109 Burger Time. You have the Akutan Zero. Hell, spend the extra money and get the Freedom Wolf. That thing will get you all the damn way to Jets, has some of the best guns in the game, and gets the freaking air spawn. Yeah, this thing, it handles like a bus. It has a freaking bugs with the oscillation thing. Trying to aim the bombs on it is a freaking exercise in futility because the way it's put internally, it has this kind of weird delay between the time you push and the time it actually lets it go. Honestly, if you want to do freaking ground pound, take the SB2C. It gets gun pods, it gets bombs, it gets a back gunner. Yeah, just no, no, don't fly bloody terrible. Well, I hope you're having fun with your event and battle pass. I hope you're not flying a bloody terrible. And I hope to see you up there in the clouds. Have a good one, y'all.